Sri Lanka Travel Budget Unraveling the Costs of Exploration In this video, we're embarking on a journey through the essential aspects of traveling to Sri Lanka for 7 to 10 days, dissecting five key elements, flight tickets, internal transportation, accommodation costs, food expenses, and entrance fees for attractions. Without further ado, let's dive into the captivating realm of exploring the travel budget in Sri Lanka. Flights Cost the cost of flight tickets hinges on your departure location. Traveling to Bandaranaik International Airport in Nigombo, which is around 35 kilometers from Colombo, from Bangalore in India, my one-way flight was approximately 120 US dollars. The return journey added another 120 US dollars, rounding it up to 240 US dollars. Prices fluctuate based on factors like the timing of ticket bookings, the time of travel, and your departure location. For this video, let's consider the flight cost as $250 US dollars, bringing our total travel cost so far to $250 US dollars. Internal travel cost. Let's delve into my itinerary to assess the expenses of traveling within Sri Lanka. A cab from Nigombo to Dambala came to $45 US dollars. The bus journey from Dambala to Kandy amounted to one US dollar. Taking the train from Kandy to Nura Ilaya incurred a cost of four US dollars. Another train ride from Nura Ilaya to Ella added one US dollar. Busing from Ella to Mirissa contributed one US dollar and 50 cents. The bus ride from Mirissa to Nagombo Airport accounted for approximately six US dollars. Exploring various locations within the cities demanded an additional 40 US dollars. Rounding off these costs, the total expenditure on travel amounts to around 100 US dollars. This brings our cumulative travel cost thus far to 350 US dollars. Accommodation cost. Determining the cost of accommodation is a nuanced task, influenced by various factors. For a comfortable stay spanning nine nights for two people, Homestays, a popular and cost-effective option, often include breakfast. During my journey, I spent a night in Nigombo, Dambala, and Nura Ilaya, and two nights each in Kandy, Ella, and Mirissa, totaling nine nights. The cumulative cost for this stay amounted to approximately 165 US dollars. While breakfast inclusion varied, excluding it brings the average nightly cost to 18 US dollars. This figure can be significantly lower for budget-friendly backpackers and higher for those seeking a more luxurious experience. With the accommodation costs now incorporated, our total travel expenditure reaches 515 US dollars. Food costs. Over nine days, I spent around 82 US dollars on food. Rounding it up to 90 US dollars makes an average of 10 US dollars per day cost for food in Sri Lanka. The total travel cost now comes to 605 US dollars. Entrance fees for attractions. Understanding that entrance fees vary for citizens and foreigners, let's break down the costs as a foreigner. During my visit, I explored different attractions. Dambala Caves, explored for 2 US dollars. Pidurangala Rock in Sigeria, wandered for 3 US dollars. Sri Daleda Maliga in Kandy, immersed in culture for 5 US dollars. Buddha Temple in Kandy, spiritual exploration for 1 US dollar. Victoria Park in Nura Elia, nature's beauty for 1 US dollar and 50 cents. Rounding up these entrance fees, the total comes to around 15 US dollars, contributing to the grand total travel cost of 620 US dollars. So, the total travel cost for Sri Lanka for 9 days would be around 620 US dollars. There are a few attractions like Lion Rock, Yala National Park, and whale watching that might cost a little more if included in your itinerary. Always check the prices online to plan your budget accordingly. Budget Breakdown for Different Travelers Now, to conclude our Sri Lanka budget, let's break down the travel cost for different types of travelers. Seven days in Sri Lanka should be doable in 500 US dollars. Ten days might cost a little above 600 US dollars. For luxury travelers, 500 US dollars to 1000 US dollars should be sufficient for seven to ten days. 
For a budget backpacker, traveling to Sri Lanka for a month can even be done in 1,000 USD. That concludes our comprehensive breakdown of the travel budget for Sri Lanka. I hope this information helps you plan your trip effectively. For any further questions comment below on the video. Happy traveling! Subscribe, like, and share to help we the travelers create more content for adventurers around the world.